Alrighty, so today I'm going to be drawing an older style of character that I don't do very much anymore, but it's a style of character that I honestly have been wanting to revisit for a couple days now. So as such, I am quite excited to well draw one of my older style characters in today's video. I'm going to be drawing in my Soho Urban Artist sketchbook that I have right here, and I'm going to be drawing with my Pilot G2 0.7 millimeter size pen. Uh, but I do think without further ado, first off, before I can go and get to drawing, I should probably flip to an open page. Uh, so let's see if I can do that. Let's see where an open page is. Da, 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 da. There we go. There's an open page. Let's just go ahead and get to that. And uh, let's go ahead and get right to drawing. So I think first off, I'm going to go ahead and do the, I want to say, I think I want first off to do the nose. So I'm just going to do the nose just like this right here kind of thing. And I am going to be giving this uh, character a little bit of a sketchy look. Uh, typically, a lot of these characters that I drew didn't have very sketchy looks. I just did one line and I was done kind of thing. It was one and done. Um, but I kind of want to give this character a little bit of a sketchy look. So that is going to be what I'm trying to do in today's video. I'm going to go ahead and give him one eye right here. And I'm going to go and give him another eye right here. And then I'm going to have that line coming down just like that. And then I'm going to have the mouth be right here. And I haven't drawn characters like this uh, in, in a while, in all honesty, and I don't know why. I think I just kind of forgot to uh, draw these characters. I kind of got hung up on drawing different styles of characters, which I've really been enjoying drawing, but I really enjoy drawing these characters as well, in all honesty. So I am quite excited to be getting back to it. And so there's the neck. Uh, the head is pretty much done. I've just got to go back over that in a little bit and then add some extra de details and whatnot. Details? Details. Getting my words all jumbled up. Let's go ahead and do the shoulders now, just like that and just like that. And let's go ahead and start on the arms. And I think I want the arms going down to about that point right there. And let's go ahead and add some actual arm lines. They actually look like arms, not just like, hey, this is a body with no arms kind of thing. And let's go ahead and have that end right there. And then I'm going to go ahead and just do that. And then I'm going to go and do that kind of thing. And I'm definitely modernizing this uh, little bit of a style of character a little bit as well kind of thing, but I want to make sure I keep the original style as well. But I definitely am modernizing how this looks a little bit as well kind of thing. And let's just go ahead and go like that kind of thing. Like that kind of thing, just like that. And let's go ahead and bring the arms down a little bit more as well. Just like that. And uh, there we go. That is pretty much the outline of the drawing all done. Uh, now I pretty much just need to go through. I need to do some more layers on the lines and whatnot. And I just need to add all the extra details that I want to add. So I'm just going to go and add some teeth real quick, whatnot. Uh, I'm not really going for like a, a super crisp or clean look, obviously. I'm just kind of going for a little bit of a rough look today. And so I'm not really too worried about having the lines line up too well or anything like that kind of thing. I'm going to have him smoking a little bit of a stogie and whatnot. And let's go and just have some lines come up like that kind of thing, just like that. Let's go ahead and give his eyes some lines as well, just like that. Let's go ahead and give his nose some lines. There we go. And let's just go ahead and give his mouth some lines as well. Got to have an ear line as well. And I'm going to have some eyebrows as well. There we go. And let's just add a little bit of a forehead line. And then now I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of a shirt line, I do suppose. And that's just going to go all the way down as the sleeves go all the way down kind of thing. And I'm going to go ahead and just add some buttons and whatnot. I'm going to go ahead and add some knee lines. And I'm just going to add some shoelaces. Just a line going down like that kind of thing, just to add some extra little detail. And I think that's pretty much all I wanted to do. Maybe I want to add, oh, nope, I almost forgot. I need to put a Joe symbol right there. All of my characters got to be wearing the Joe merch, you know what I'm saying? They all, I, I say as I don't have any Joe merch out, at least at the recording of this video, I really should make some. I really should make some, in all honesty. I have some ideas, but uh, all of the ideas are a little bit ambitious uh, for me right now. So I really want to make some Joe merch. I definitely do need to do that, I ain't gonna lie. Uh, but I do think without further ado, it's now time for me to go ahead and start adding a second layer onto most of this drawing. Um, a lot of the drawing looks pretty good in my opinion, but I do definitely think a lot of it also needs 
needs a second layer. So I'm going to go ahead and start adding that second layer. Just give it a little bit more of a rougher, darker look. That's pretty much the plan. And uh, let's just uh, let's just do that real quick. I'm very happy with how this drawing is turning out, though, I ain't gonna lie. It feels like a modernized version of this older style of drawing that I used to do an absolute shit ton. And um, I am very, very, very happy to be revisiting this style. It's lots of fun, I ain't gonna lie. Lots of fun to draw. Really simple to draw. It doesn't take too long. Just lots of fun kind of thing. But I feel like the characters uh, drawn in this style have a decent amount of personality. And uh, I, I just really enjoy drawing in this style, I ain't gonna lie. It really is a lot of fun. And I'm glad to be modernizing it a little bit in today's video, that is for sure. There we go. And let's go and do the other shoe now. Let's go ahead and add a second layer onto the Joe logo. Joe Mama. And I'm thinking that's pretty much the drawing all done. I do kind of want to add some texture to one part of the drawing, so I do think I'm just going to add some lines, like right here, that just go across kind of thing. I do think I just want to add a little bit of texture, and I'm thinking that's kind of the texture I want to add. So I'm just going to go over and do that real quick, just like that. And maybe go across like that as well kind of thing, just to add some texture to the bottom part of the drawing, just to make it all look uh, a little bit just uh, differentiated from the rest of the drawing kind of thing. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Um, and honestly, I do kind of regret that, but also not really at the same time. Uh, taking a look at this drawing from a distance, I think it turned out pretty well. I am very happy with this drawing, I can lie. I really, really, really do like this drawing. It feels like I took one of my old characters and modernized it, and I just overall am honestly super happy with how this turned out. Certainly no complaints on my behalf. No, I'm really happy with it. I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video where I drew one of my old style characters uh, with a Pilot G2 pen in 0.7 millimeter size. If you guys uh, have enjoyed watching this video, of course, please make sure to leave some constructive criticism or just your thoughts on the drawing in the comments down below. And of course, please make sure to uh, like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram, my book, my merch, my PO box, and my uh, main channel all in the description down below. Go check it all out. But, you know, thank you so much for watching, y'all. To the next one, uh, stay safe and peace and have a great one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying.